Hi there, young math whizzes. Ready for a multiplication challenge? Jump into our Math Quiz for Kids channel for 20 exciting multiplication questions. Don't forget to like and subscribe to join in on the fun. Question 1. 5 times 9 equals what? So, the answer is 5 times 9 is 45. To calculate, we have 5 groups with 9 balls each one. So, how many balls do we have? 45 balls. Question 2. 3 times 5 equals what? So the answer is 3 times 5 is 15. To calculate, we have 3 groups with 5 balls each one. So how many balls do we have? 15 balls. Question 3. 7 times 2 equals what? So the answer is 7 times 2 is 14. To calculate, we have 7 groups with 2 balls each one. So how many balls do we have? 14 balls. Question 4. 2 times 3 equals what? So the answer is 2 times 3 is 6. To calculate, we have two groups with three balls each one. So how many balls do we have? Six balls. Question 5. 8 times 2 equals what? So, the answer is 8 times 2 is 16. To calculate, we have 8 groups with 2 balls each one. So, how many balls do we have? 16 balls. Question 6. 7 times 5 equals what? So, the answer is 7 times 5 is 35. To calculate, we have 7 groups with 5 balls each one. So, how many balls do we have? 35 balls. Question 7. 7 times 4 equals what? So the answer is 7 times 4 is 28. To calculate, we have 7 groups with 4 balls each one. So how many balls do we have? 28 balls. Question 8. 2 times 6 equals what?
So the answer is 2 times 6 is 12. To calculate, we have two groups with six balls each one. So how many balls do we have? 12 balls. Question nine, five times seven equals what? So the answer is five times seven is 35. To calculate, we have five groups with seven balls each one. So how many balls do we have? 35 balls. Question 10. Four times three equals what? So, the answer is four times three is 12. To calculate, we have four groups with three balls each one. So, how many balls do we have? 12 balls. Question 11. 9 times 8 equals what? So the answer is 9 times 8 is 72. To calculate, we have 9 groups with 8 balls each one. So how many balls do we have? 72 balls. Question 12. 9 times 9 equals what? So the answer is 9 times 9 is 81. To calculate, we have 9 groups with 9 balls each one. So how many balls do we have? 81 balls. Question 13. 4 times 2 equals what? So, the answer is 4 times 2 is 8. To calculate, we have 4 groups with 2 balls each one. So, how many balls do we have? 8 balls. Question 14. 2 times 9 equals what? So, the answer is 2 times 9 is 18. To calculate, we have two groups with 9 balls each one. So how many balls do we have? 18 balls. Question 15. 4 times 9 equals what? So, the answer is 4 times 9 is 36. To calculate, we have 4 groups with 9 balls each one. So, how many balls do we have? 36 balls. Question 16. 
Seven times seven equals what? So the answer is seven times seven is 49. To calculate, we have seven groups with seven balls each one. So how many balls do we have? 49 balls. Question 17. Four times nine equals what? So the answer is four times nine is 36. To calculate, we have four groups with nine balls each one. So how many balls do we have? 36 balls. Question 18. Eight times one equals what? So, the answer is, eight times one is eight. To calculate, we have eight groups with one balls each one. So, how many balls do we have? Eight balls. Question 19. Four times five equals what? So the answer is four times five is 20. To calculate, we have four groups with five balls each one. So how many balls do we have? 20 balls. Question 20, seven times nine equals what? So the answer is seven times nine is 63. To calculate, we have seven groups with nine balls each one. So how many balls do we have? 63 balls. How many did you get right? We bet you did awesome. Remember, practice makes perfect. Don't forget to click the like button if you had fun and subscribe so you can join us for even more math quiz adventures. Let's keep the math magic alive.